Hello everyone and welcome to this tutorial on navigating through your portal settings in your admin dashboard. So let's go to our admin dashboard, click on this icon up here, and then click on administration. Bring you to administrator dashboard and you'll click on the portal settings tab. And here I'm going to be explaining all the uh, giving you an overview on the different tabs in portal settings so first we have theme settings this lets you change things like fonts colors menus images uh, displays and it's basically your overall user interface aesthetics we go to website settings Website settings lets you manipulate things like links, functionality, um, user settings, and also certain campaign settings. And for instance, you want to auto approve a new campaign. Let's go to campaign settings. Now, this lets you do things uh, like campaign functionality and also lets you put restrictions on the campaigns and the campaign managers and you know, some of the things that the campaign managers can do this has nothing to do with the uh, the payment processing of the campaigns let's go to the payment settings now this lets you manipulate how clients payments will be processed um, where the funding will be collected and uh, also the transaction fee so say a user creates a campaign and that campaign gets donations you can take a percentage of those donations let's go to the comment settings this is just the basic um, uh, comment functionality and also the user interface aesthetics right? so you want to change the colors of the font or the background let's go to widget settings uh, this lets you add um, or choose between different widgets that you want it that you want to use on your site custom fields this lets you add uh, more user profile information because it's whether it's the business profile or the personal profile and email notification uh, this lets you toggle between uh, the different email notifications if you don't want to send emails or if you do and it also lets you edit the emails as well if you click on that you can edit the subject and the content inside of it there's also available tokens so say if you want to make these emails more personalized you can add um, the name of the campaign manager so uh, once a campaign is approved then the manager will receive an email and uh, say if you want to have the managers first name in the email you just click on that and that will give you the token there you can cut that say hello let's just say this campaign managers name is Bob you could say hello Bob and then you can read the email makes it more personalized for every single um, every single email you you'll be sending out here so I hope this helps you navigate through your portal settings there's a lot of different things you can do here um, yeah have a good one